Well, it looks like Morello is really trying to make me mad. But I'm a reasonable person. What do they call you, son? Thomas Angelo. I've decided to give you a shot, Tommy. I like new faces. We're one big family here. Do you already know Paulie and Sam? Frank here is my right hand and looks after the legal side of our business. The one behind the bar is Luigi. This business ain't easy to swallow, but Luigi's a wonderful cook. Paul will introduce you to Vincenzo and Ralph. There are a lot of us, but those should be enough for now. Now listen, and listen good. We have some rules around here. Don't cross paths with the cops. They're on our payroll, so they'll leave you alone. But if you go too far, they'll all come after you. Money or no money. If they ever pick you up, say nothing, and I will take care of you. I show my gratitude to those people that helped me, and there aren't many left to betray me. Capiche? Yes, Mr. Salieri. I'm glad. Today I'll give you a chance to get back at those bastards who wrecked your taxi. We'll see what you're made of. Morello has a bar where all his gorillas go. They all have their cars parked behind the fence next to the bar. If you're good, they won't be there tomorrow morning. <laughs> Paulie will go with you just in case. Go see Vincenzo for equipment and Ralph for some wheels. I wouldn't trust him so much. He seemed hesitant. He's just accepted now because he has no choice. We'll see, Frank. We'll see. I'm more concerned about what Morello's problem is. Does he really want to start a war? Vincenzo is a Don's gun expert. They've known each other since they were kids. He gets you whatever you want. Tommy guns to cannons. Minnie can set you up. I always pay him a visit before a job. Buono giorno, Vincenzo. Ciao, Pauli. This here's Tom. Just started up with us. Pleased to meet you, Tom. What can I do for the both of you? We got a job to do. We need something to write off a few cars. This classic piece of sports equipment should do the job, and if not, I've mixed up a few cocktails. Careful with him, though. Nice a lot, Vincenzo. Bring back the bat. It's my nephew's. Sure thing. Ralph, I'll introduce you to, is a complete idiot, but he's got a special way with cars. I don't get how such a moron could know anything about anything, but that's the way it goes sometimes. <laughs> a v v v v visit. How you all doing, Polly? Hey, Ralphie. Yeah, I s s see you're still limping, so we got two c c cripples working here. That's right, but I ain't a fool. Um, uh -huh. Ralph, this is Tom. If you bring him a stolen car, Tommy, I'll make it your own, and no one will know the difference. Ralph, Tom and me have a job to do. You're supposed to have some wheels for us? Right. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> it ain't no hot rod, <laughs> but it should really do for you. Thanks, Ralphie. Let's go.
Okay, we're here. Don't go through the front. Find another way. They got the guy quietly so you don't arouse any attention. Smash the cars up with the bat and save the fireworks for last. Could be some nice night shit. Take a look. Good luck, buddy. Thanks. I'll be back in a little while.
So we're back, boss. Wonderful. Take a seat. It all went well. Sure, boss. He's a natural. Before they could say gun only, they were wheelers. And before they could recover, we were gone. Morello is probably pretty pissed right now. Really? I'm glad to hear it. He's one tough customer. In that case, welcome to the family, Tommy. You've passed the first it's test. It's an honor, sir. And now we've got a new member. I'd like to take him into the outfit, boss. You can see he ain't scared. And he's done real good. You didn't disappoint me, Tommy. Now, let's drink. Thanks. 